When you come to a crossroad and run into the winner and the quitter in you, listen to the winner. The quitter will never take you down the road you want to travel. I believe we all have a winner in us. There is a winner inside of you. Sometimes we just have been around negativity for way too long. Develop the mindset of a winner. The truth is, most people give up on their dream. Most people give up on their dream to live the average lifestyle. But it really doesn't matter what most people do. What do you do? Because you are different. You will never give up on your dream. You will never not listen to the average. You will always listen to the winner in you. You will believe in yourself when no one else does. You will believe in yourself when you have no reason to believe. And you will never, ever quit. I know some of you are going through a rough time right now. Some of you are going through the fight of your life. Fighting for your future. Fighting for your career. Fighting for your family. Some of you are fighting for your life. And I'm telling you, don't quit. Do not give in. I know life can be tough. I know life can wear you down. But if you just stick it out, even if you don't get the result you will find, the character you show will be your reward. The fighting spirit you develop will be the reward, and it will serve you well for the rest of your life. Fight for what you want now, or fight against what you don't want later. You choose. Don't you dare quit. Don't you dare settle. Don't you dare get back down. Not today or any other day. When the tough moments come, never forget, you are in that moment writing your own legacy. In that tough moment, you are setting the standard for your character. Do you have the character? Well, do you? When you come to a crossroad and run into the winner and the quitter in you, listen to the winner. When you make a commitment to yourself, you make sure you see it through. Never, ever quit. Even if you don't get the result, you will find the character you show will be your reward. Don't you dare quit. Don't you dare ever settle. And don't you dare ever back down. Fight for what you want or fight against what you don't want at a later time. And always know that God is right there with you. Just allow God to guide and direct you. And you will always be a winner. Hello, my name is Ralph Friedrichs. I'm an addiction recovery coach, a life coach, and the host of this show, The Take Your Life Back Today radio show, in combination with the YouTube version on YouTube channel, Take Your Life Back Today show. <clears throat> Sunday, today, rainy day. Somehow people lack motivation. I don't. I want to talk about motivation. It's easy to have faith when everything is going to work out. When everything is working out and things are smooth. It's much harder to have faith when you are facing challenges in your life. But that is exactly when you need to apply your faith, my friends. Because faith is believing in the unforeseen. Faith is taking the first step. Faith is jumping in the deep end, knowing everything will be okay at the end of the day. It's easy to be positive when everything is working out. It's much harder, much, much harder when nothing is working out. But that's when we need it most. Everything is worth the prize at that time. It's worth the fight at that time. Everything worth the prize will require a real fight to achieve that prize. If you want that prize, my friends, you can't quit half uh, way through. You can't quit mid-season. You must play the whole game. If you quit or if you approach preseason through the cold, through the darkness, through the challenges, through the opponents, you will be knocked down, but you must get up. Keep fighting. Dig deep and, uh, and deeper and discover your true strength. Then you will win the real prize. Character expansion, you rising to the next level. If I survive the storm, I can outdo the norm. To break through the norm, I must first survive the storm. To have more than most, I must do more than most. Believe more than most. Learn more than most. And then sacrifice more than most. Believe them more than most. Now say it to you, to you to yourself. Long term, I know what I need will come my way. Long term, term, I know if I keep at it, it will be rewarded. Long term, I know consistency pays off. Long term, I know 
all my actions, all my dis uh, discipline, all my integrity will pay off in a big way. I have faith. Everything will work out. In the end, all will be fine if I keep working, if I keep learning, if I continue to evolve, if I continue to adapt, if I learn new ways, everything will work out. Setbacks aren't always negative. Sometimes they are sent to guide us in the much bigger, better direction. But you can only see that if you show character in those hard times, my friends. If you remain open-minded in the hard times, friends, if you show strength through your uh, struggles, don't say, why me? Ask, how can I come out of this even stronger? What can I learn in the hard times we see who really has the character? In the hard times, we see what people are really made of. What are you made of? Tell me. Just tell me. What are you made of? Character? Expansion? Growth? And pride? Character, expansion, and growth, and pride. Think about those words. Dig deep. Find the strength that lives inside of you right now. Trust that if you keep doing your thing, you will re, uh, be rewarded. It might not happen right away. It rarely does, but it will happen if you keep going. Don't allow regret to enter your life at any time. Don't you dare look back in your life in five years and, and think, I could have done more if only I stuck it out. I could have ha uh, been much uh, 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 in a much better position. No. Look back with pride. Look back with accomplishments. Look back and be able to say to yourself, it wasn't easy, but I am so proud I stuck to it and I stuck it out because I got my rewards. Make sure your story is one of strength. Make sure your story is one of someone who refused to ever give up, refused to settle, refused to be normal. Keep going. Your future self is begging you to never stop. Call me at 844-405-HELP. Together, you and I, we can help each other take our lives back. Be good to yourselves. Always be good to each other. That neighbor living right next door to you, that's right, that old lady, that old man, a simple smile to them each and every day can change their life and can change your life. Never, ever give up. Be what God designated you to be, a winner an accomplished person, and may God bless each and every one of you. We'll talk to you guys tomorrow. Take good care. God bless each and every one of you. Take good care. Bye-bye now. Thank you.